Hello and welcome back to my channel. Life has been crazy. Um, so if you don't follow me on social media, which you should, everything's down below. Alex and I welcomed our sweet baby boy into the world. Um, he is almost two weeks old. I don't know where this time is going. Um, I'm sitting here watching him sleep right now while I film these videos today. Um, it's in between feeding, so he's milk drunk right now and knocked out. Um, so if you hear any grunting or anything in the middle of this video, it's just him sleeping. Um, so yeah, I have a bunch of videos that I want to get up for you guys. The first one is going to be this kind of dramatic green holiday look, which I really like the way that it turned out. Um, I do want to do um, a video all about um, my pregnancy, my labor and delivery, um, motherhood thus far. So I, I don't know when I'll be filming that. Um, I, I kind of want to get some ideas and stuff and kind of get that video laid out before I actually film it. Um, so if anybody has any questions, if you are thinking about being a mom or you're just curious about my experiences or anything like that, leave some comments down below. I will answer any questions in that video. Um, and yeah, I think that's it. I'm going to stop rambling. So if you guys want to see how I got this green Christmas look, then just keep watching. So my whole face is done, including bronzer. Love, Bubby. <laughs> um, so I have my whole face done, including my bronzer, um, my brows, my foundation, all of that good stuff. My eyes are primed with a little bit of concealer. The first thing I'm going to do is take my Lorac Pro palette, and I'm going to take the color taupe and just pop a little bit of that in my crease for the transition shade because we're gonna do like a bright green not bright green like a emerald green lid but I just want the nice warm brown in the crease before we put any color on our lids just to kind of show where we don't want to go above and because we're doing such a th dark lid I'm not going to do any liquid liner today, oh, which is going to be so weird for me because I love my liquid liner, but we are going to do false lashes. Next we're going to take the color Sable, which is just, sorry I don't know if I'm blinding you, which is just a lot darker of a brown and we're going to focus this more in the crease as well as the outer corner. Next I'm going to be taking this Revlon Photo Ready Eye Art and this is in, I don't know what the color this is in, oh Desert Dazzle which it has like the nice green with the sparkly kind of bronzy green but we're just going to use this end and we're going to use this to prime our lids and get ready for that green shadow. And this is a cream, in case you were wondering. And then we're going to be taking the L'Oreal Infallible um, Eyeshadow in Golden Emerald, which is just a really pretty emerald green, and placing this all over that cream. You see how just beautiful that is with that cream underneath of it. I'm going to be taking more of that sable color, which is that dark brown, and kind of blending out the crease so that way it's not just like a harsh green line. Because you kind of want everything to just blend together. We don't like harsh lines unless it's a cut crease, which this is not, so no harsh lines. so Christmassy. And then I'm just going to take a fluffy brush and kind of wipe away any fallout that was under there. Because I don't want green glitter on my under eyes, you know what I'm saying? 
I'm going to take the ColourPop Cream Gel Liner, and this is in the color Swerve. It's just a black liner, and I'm going to tight line and do my water line with this. Since we're not doing any liquid liner, we're going tight line, which I hate tight lining. Ugh. I don't mind it on my um, lower lash line, but tight lining sucks. going to put on some falsies. I'm just using the Ardell Studio FX um, custom lashes in there, the Demi Wispies, and just some duo lash glue. I hate putting on false eyelashes. I'm okay once they're on, but it's the putting them on. Now that those are finally on, I'm just going to put some, <coughs> put some mascara on to blend my regular lashes with the falsies and then the lower lash line. I'm going to be taking that same sable color we put in our crease and running this under my lower lash line to kind of smoke it out some. For blush, I'm using this Milani blush in the color Romantic Rose and just a big fluffy brush. Popping this on my cheeks. It's a nice neutral pink blush, good for any look, especially a dramatic one like this. For highlight, I'm using the Tarte Amazonian Clay Highlighter in um, Stunner, which is just really pretty champagne-y color. I'm just popping this on my cheekbones. Right above the eyebrows, the tip of the nose, the cupid's bow. I'm also going to be using this to highlight my brow bone and tear duct. Just a little bit. Nothing too crazy. For lips, I'm going to go more for a nude lip. You could um, jazz it up and do a red lip, but with this dramatic eye, I think I just want to stick with more of a nude, which I'm using more of a brownie nude, um, but you can use more of like a nude nude if you want. I'm going to be lining my lips with the Jordana Tony Lip Liner. And my lips are jacked from this cold weather. Anybody else? Or just me. And then for the lip color itself, I'm going to be using this Anastasia Beverly Hills Liquid Lip in Bittersweet, which again is more of like a brownie nude. finish everything off, I'm going to be setting it with the Cover FX Illuminating Setting Spray. And that is my completed holiday Christmas look. I hope you enjoyed. I think I'm going to do a little bit less of a dramatic one, um, more of like a neutral eye with maybe a red lip um, here before Christmas. I'm gonna try to pop these videos out. Um, so yeah, I think that's it. Stay tuned because I do have more videos coming and...
yeah, make sure to hit that subscribe button. Make sure to like it, leave comments, um, follow my social media. All that's down below. And yeah, so again, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you next time. Bye guys.